Hey everybody, today let's talk about absolute versus relative set points. As you see here, we got a Johnson controller uh, NS8000 stat. Uh, this is the 240 series, right? This stat just happens to have uh, humidity built into it, but it doesn't matter if it does or not. But Johnson calls absolute set point, um, set point adjust. They call relative set point warm cool adjust, right? So absolute is a number, an absolute number. As you see here, 66, 65, that's absolute. So that's set point adjust in Johnson terms. Relative would be us giving the, the controller a network set point, let's say 70 degrees. And then the operator has an adjustment up or down from that 70 degrees, right? They they don't really know the set point, but they know it can go up from the set point and go down from the set point. It can make it warmer. It can make it cooler. Now on this stat, right now, we're set up for absolute, right? We're set up for set point adjust. We can make this stat relative. We can make this stat warm cool adjust. Let's go and see how to do that. I already have the program here. We got set point adjust. All we have to do is change the set point adjust to warm cool adjust. So go back into system select. Right here, we got common set point adjust. Again, that's absolute. Warm cool adjust, that's relative. Let's change it. It's going to change to warm cool adjust over here. We have to go to point assignments to drop our points in. And then we can transfer it to device and watch what happens to the stat. Okay, that's downloaded. I can hear the actuator moving now. Oh, look at this. We got a relative set point. Other than that, the stat looks the same. But now we got warm cool adjust. As you notice in the upper corner there, we don't have the actual set point, but we have the what's a relative to the set point. We're we're minus three degrees from the set point right now. We don't know what that set point is, but we are minus three degrees.